Hi, I'm Dave Esty, and I'm a registered piano technician with the Piano Technicians Guild. I have been tuning and rebuilding pianos and buying and selling pianos for over 35 years. Now, I know that I look like I'm 29, but I'm actually much older. Now, I know you're here and you, you want to sell your piano, and, and you just want to know what your piano is worth. Well, I, you know, I understand, and if you would like a technician to come out to your home and to examine the piano, we could certainly do that. But if you want to find out at the lowest cost what your piano might be worth, well then, this is what this website is all about. The first thing you have to do is you have to find out what you have. Because I get a lot of phone calls, you know, and emails, and they'll say, um, I have a, um, I have an SD uh, upright piano, serial number one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. What's it worth? Well, I have no idea what it's worth. First off, I gotta go look up the serial number, find out how old it is, and secondly, I have to understand what kind of condition that it's in. Now, if the piano hasn't been tuned for 50 years and it's 100 years old, well, guess what the condition is probably going to be? So that's what this website is all about. Step one is find out what you have. Well, you say, Dave, I've got an upright piano. Well, there's four different kinds of uprights. There's a full-size upright, there's a studio upright, there's a console, and there's a spinet. Do you know what you have? Well, what's the difference? Well, go through the virtual appraisal and figure out what you have. Now, once you've figured out what you have and how old it is, then we have to figure out what kind of condition it's in. Because even a Steinway, the value of a Steinway has a whole lot to do with the condition. If the piano needs to be totally restored, it's not going to be worth as much as if it's in pristine, mint condition and all ready to go. So, and the formula that we use is we'll find out what your piano can sell for in top condition, and then we figure out if your piano is in top condition, then go for it, sell it for that amount. But if it's not in top condition, there has, there's work that needs to be done in order to get it there. And the price of that work is deducted from the amount that it would uh, normally sell for in pristine mint condition. So this section is all about determining the condition of the piano. Level one is a do-it-yourself kind of thing. And you get an ebook and you get a webinar. And it enables you to open up the lid of the piano and take a look at certain specific components to determine whether or not the piano might have value. The level two appraisal is uh, everything that you get with the level one, which is the ebook and the webinar, but also you can send me some pictures and I will personally review them and then give you my professional opinion. Level three is where we talk on the phone, we do the email, and you get the um, and you get the webinar and the ebook. Uh, level four is where you say, Dave, I don't want to do any of this. I just want you to come out and take a look at the piano uh, and tell me what it's worth. And then level five is only after we find out that the piano has significant value, uh, then I would uh, get involved with ass assisting you with selling it and advertising and so forth. So choose the level of appraisal which would work best for you and, uh, and I wish you all the best and I hope you get top dollar for your piano.